Hey everyone, welcome to Foxtech again. This time we talk about iPhone and the payment method, which you can use. And the topic is how can you add a payment method other than a credit card on your iPhone for Apple payments? So of course, open up the settings like that. And at the top, you should see your profile picture as well as your name. So this is like the presumption or something I assume that you have already. So just click on that and I want you to go to the payment and shipping. So you can see I already have like one payment method there. But the thing is that if you're trying to add a new payment method like this, you're going to be able to notice that you have some different options available. So you have the Apple Pay, um, the credit and debit card like Visa, MasterCard and everything. But you also have the phone and number, which is very interesting. If you click on mobile phone, you can see that it tells you right away if it's available for you. It's going to tell you that mobile phone billing is available in your country or perhaps it's not. But just try it out using these uh, uh, cell providers. A verification code will be sent to your phone. If you continue uh, with the mobile phone billing, it will be provided on the network's terms and conditions. So, <clears throat> for example, as you can see right here. Uh, this is like a different way of adding a payment method. You don't actually use a credit card and you are not allowed or like required to do it because you can use your literal credit from the SIM card to pay for apps and songs and subscriptions. So this would be technically a way to add a payment method without the credit card. So that's how it works. Or if you really want to just go without it, you don't even technically have to have one because if you're setting up the Apple ID, you're going to notice that there is the option to add none or nothing as the payment method. So if you just go ahead and just, I'm, I'm going to show it to you right now. Like if you go ahead and just literally look it up in Google, you're going to notice that no um, payment method. If I just look it up like this on Apple ID, you're going to notice that when setting it up like that, you can see that this is what you're, you can get. So you're going to get like none. I've shown you the entire process when I was just setting up the Apple ID on this channel. So you can watch that video if you want. But basically, you have the option to add it as none. But this will only allow you to download free apps. And it's not like you, you cannot get any free trials or subscriptions or payments, of course, because you don't have a payment method. So you have like this none method or perhaps you, you can be stuck with the mobile phone credit. So these are the options which you have in case you don't want to add an actual credit card to the Apple payments. But that's basically it. Besides that, there are so many different things you should know about your iPhone. That's why you need to check out the Foxtech educational platform down below. It is free to access. And there are so many different courses. I just finished in-depth Dynamic Island course with many different things to, to watch there, like tips and built-in functions, third-party apps, wallpapers, Everything is accessible for free, so go ahead and do that right now. I will wait for you inside. And yeah, that's going to be about it for now. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you in the next future tutorial.